hello guys welcome back to get Roll tips in this video i'm going to show you how to bypass google verification on any xiaomi smartphones to demonstrate this now i am using my poco f1 and you can use the same method on your mi or redmi device too so as you can see my device is uh, locked and uh, it is asking for google verification which i don't have so today I'm going to show you how to bypass this Google verification screen. So let's go back and from here choose any language which is not using QWERTY system such as French, Greek, Russian etc. Okay let me choose uh, okay let me choose this one right now. Okay once after that you need to connect to the uh, Wi-Fi network. I have already connected to Wi-Fi available here. Once you connected to network, choose this last option and you need to tap here so that the keyboard pops up. Once after that, you need to tap and hold space bar so that you can choose the QRT keyboard. Okay. Once after that, you need to choose this third option from here. Okay. So once you are here, select this button from the bottom and select any of the text which have the arrow key so let me choose this one from here you need to choose this three dot button and select the second option so you will get a search bar here so you need to search for mos m o r s c oh, sorry you will get use most code option just select this option so you will get uh, one youtube video just tap on that so it will show a three dot button in the youtube video select that and choose watch later now you need to select the browser which is available accept the permission and once you are in browser you need to go to our website get droid tips dot co ok first you need to search for google account manager so you will get download google account manager apk for old android version tap this uh, article and you need to download google account manager first okay let me download google account manager 5xx lollipop from google drive just now click download okay Once it is downloaded, you will get the pop-up to install it. Select that. Select the Google Account Manager and install it. Create the permission. Okay, done. Now go back. Once after you install Google Account Manager, search for all frp bypass all frp bypass now just search for it once the search results comes you need to select this first article which called all frp bypass tools and drivers for pc download frp tools for free select this one this article and uh, scroll down to and scroll down to here to download both Google Account Manager and FRP Bypass APK. Here also you will get Google Account Manager. I have already downloaded from another article. Once after downloading and installing Google Account Manager, you need to install FRP Bypass APK. I will choose Google Drive link. Download.
so once after the download you will get uh, a pop-up of to install it just install the application now you need to open the app once you open the app you will you will get into this interface you just need to select this three dot button and select the first option agree the permission okay here you will be asked to sign into Google account so let me sign into my account so once it is done it is basically logged in so now you need to reboot the device first let me go back and choose English so that I can understand whatever it may be Here you usually get Google verification page but as you can see here it shows account added and uh, my account is being shown here. Now I can just click next and so after that let me accept everything. Let me set up fast since we need to format the device once more. So that's it we are successfully bypassed Google verification screen. Even though we just need to format once again for complete bypass since we don't want enemies in future so let me go to settings here you need to go to about phone and uh, choose backup and reset here you can erase all the data which is factory reset select reset phone and you need to make a complete format of your device once again let me agree the permissions so the device get formatted okay it may take a couple of minutes to get rebooted since after the format so let's wait for it yes it takes around 3 minutes for my device to get rebooted after the format. So let me set up this quickly. And this time you can see we are not asked for any Google verification. So that's it guys, we are successfully bypassed Google verification. If this video really helped you out, I suggest you to like and share your thoughts in the comment section. If you face any trouble in between, let us know. This is Hazrat from Get Tips. Thank you.